Hello, I'm Daryl. And I'm Renee. And we're going to do a junk fooding for you today. This is actually the first one we've recorded for the R&DW Adventures uh, series, a channel that we uh, created. And we went to the store yesterday, the local Japanese market, and we've got these three uh, different types of Kit Kat. And for a little bit of context, we're on April, uh, what is it, April 12th, 2020, yes. Easter Day, and we're still under lockdown here in Metro Detroit. So it was an interesting experience just going to the market, <laughs> and we figured this would be the perfect time to give it a shot. This right. is actually the first junk fooding we've ever done recorded. Yes. So hopefully this is <laughs> going to be a little bit better quality. YouTube won't let us do live streaming, at least yet. Hopefully in the near future. We'll so, you know, maybe we'll do more of these, maybe we won't. So we have the roasted tea, the orange, and the custard that we're going to be trying today. That's the one I'm most interested in. The custard? Yes. I, I don't know. The orange kind of scares me. A little bit. Because orange is usually like that, uh, that white chocolate thing that I don't like. Right. Tea might be interesting. But I really do, you know, we've tried a few of the other Kit Kats. Matcha's gross. The matcha was really <laughs> gross. The mint was okay. The mint was really good, actually. Well, there's well, two different mints that we tried. Not the mint chocolate, the mint inside part. The, well, they, there was an Asian mint that wasn't okay, but there was an American one that was actually pretty good. That's true. Or, well, North American, probably. So we're going to give these a shot. Let's go ahead and take them down. We had to stick them to the table. So let's start off with the tea. Okay. Yeah. Yep, bring out the uh, plate. So we have the tea. All right, so we're opening up the orange. Okay, talk about disgusting. That orange really looks bad. If it tastes like a creamsicle, it would be okay. And then, the last one is the custard. It smells funny. The orange one has a cat on it. You I did. Alright, so... The, uh, which one let's actually give this a shot. One of them really stinks. I don't know which one it is. Uh, give me one of the uh, custards, please. Get that out of the way. Alright, so we'll start with the tea. Oops, okay. I'm good. This one kind of stinks, but I kind of like it. It tastes way better than it smells. Yeah. It absolutely tastes way better than it smells. The texture is a little strange. It's definitely like really a stuff. white chocolate. Yeah. And which I'm not a fan of white chocolate. But this is not terrible. There's gritty stuff in the um. Yeah, it actually has chocolate. like bits of tea, I think. I think you're right. So, yeah, that's not bad. Mm -mm. I don't if think If you I... like uh, tea, you'd probably like it. And then the orange. That's better than I thought it would be. We should have had a uh, palate cleanser in there. We should have. But I kind of like this one. It does taste like a it's creamsicle. It's like a zesty creamsicle, yeah. Like a push-up. Yeah, with uh, a little bit the of cookie the in there. Yeah. The little cake. Uh, that's way better than I thought it would be. That's actually pretty good. I like that one. Mm -hmm. Do you want me to get a palate cleanser? No. And then, you're uh, anxious to try this custard, so let's try the custard. You need to get rid of that orange flavor. Orange tea flavor. Tastes like vanilla. Yeah, it's about all I taste is the vanilla on this. It tastes like meringue. But I don't really taste the white chocolate. I don't either. It tastes kind of like meringue, I think. So. I think I kind of like this one. Which one do you like best? Of the three, mm -hmm. I think I like the orange the best. Me too. Oddly. That's the one I thought I'd like the least. Yeah. Mm. 
But orange, tea, and custard are uh, mine. How about yours? Probably the same. Orange, tea, then custard. All right. So that's what we're looking at, guys. Uh, I w don't think I'd buy them again. Any of them. But definitely, yeah, definitely interesting. Uh, the glad you tried them. good with ice cream. Like frozen, the orange ones are probably no, really good. No, the tea would be really good with uh, ice cream, I think. What kind of ice cream? I'm not sure. But I was kind of thinking like the uh, coconut ice cream would probably be even good. But, okay. Yeah, so it, I could see that actually working out. All right. Like a Thai tea ice cream flavor? Something like that. Okay. So, yeah, overall, uh, we liked them. They're uh, interesting, but not, not them. worth getting again. On a scale of uh, one being bad, five being the best, I'd say three. at best, we're looking at a three. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Uh, three. May maybe we're three and a half on the orange and like uh, two and a half on the custard for me. I'd give the custard a two. Two. All right. So there we are. Thanks for uh, checking out the video and make sure to subscribe. And uh, hopefully we'll be going live with some new videos in the future. But we'll definitely have more uh, junk food going on because we're we got, bored. We got a ton of stuff and we're bored. So, this is just the first of hopefully many.